before operating the machine, thoroughly read safety and operation information in the operator's manual. Press the Harvest Information button on the home screen. The Work Area screen will display two module counters. The lower counter displays the module count since the last reset. Press the Reset button to zero the counter. The upper counter displays the total module account during the life of the machine and cannot be reset. The Machine Configuration button displays the Machine Configuration screen. The menu area changes to display menu buttons specific to system configuration functions available in the configuration screen. Menu buttons common to both CP690 and CS690 are Round Module Builder, Cotton Fan, Header, Moisture Flush, and Video Setup. In addition to these common systems, the CP690 also includes a header height control configuration button. The CS690 menus include a cleaner configuration function. The round module builder setup screen opens by default when selecting the machine configuration button from the home page menus. The RMB setup screen displays remaining wrap portions on the wrap roll, target module size, and on the CP690, the compactor auger mode. Select the wrap portion cell and use the keypad to change wrap portions remaining if necessary and accept. Select the target module size cell and use the keypad to change the target module size and accept. The machine is capable of forming and wrapping round modules up to 238 centimeters or 94 inches in diameter. The factory default setting is 228 centimeters or 90 inches as larger modules can be damaged if transported in module trucks. Always measure module diameter and size modules according to handling equipment, transportation method, and Jenner recommendations. The cotton fan menu button opens a screen which displays the cotton fan speed alarm set point cell and cotton fan engage disable setting. Press the fan alarm cell to change the set point. Press the default button to return the alarm speed to the original factory setting. On the CS690, press and release the fan engage disabled checkbox to allow operation of the cleaner without the fan engaged if desired. Press the checkbox again to return fan operation to normal. The Header Setup menu button on CP690 opens a screen which displays the header type and number of row units detected by the system. The Header Setup function on the CS690 includes header speed and alarm adjustments. The Moistener System Flush menu button opens a screen which allows adjustment of the length of time the CP690 Moistener System flushing continues after pressing the flush button. On CS690, the length of activation of the saw drum cleaning spray nozzles is adjusted. Select the flush timer cell to change the timer setting. Press the default button to return the flush time to the original factory setting. For more detailed information, refer to the operator's manual.